it's Allison. I am back in the My Disney Experience, this time to show you how to make your Fast Pass selections, the fun part of the My Disney Experience. So of course you're going to go to DisneyWorld.com, you're going to log into your account and go into your My Disney Experience, then we're going to scroll down to where it says Make Fast Pass Plus Selections. Now, of course, you'll still want to consult your travel agent and make sure you're optimizing your time, the crowds, and, and all of that before you make your selections. They can still kind of help you to beat the crowds, even though the Fast Pass Plus is amazing. You still will hit some crowds and the lines and things like that. So you still want to make sure that you're selecting the best theme parks on the best day of your vacation and still optimizing your vacation and picking the best rides and attractions for your family. So make sure you still consult with your agent and help them um, help them help you get your itinerary plans. But once you deal with that and you know what you need to book, then you can come into this Fast Pass Plus selection area to pick what rides and attractions and shows you want to use with your Fast Pass. So the day I'm selecting, I'm going to go ahead and do September 16th, which is Monday. So I'm just going to click on that and then hit next. And then, of course, I'm going to select myself. And then if you have other people in your party, you're going to select everybody in your party. Because you all want to do everything together. Or if you're going to split up, you can do two people on one thing and two people on the other thing. So let's see. Let's do Magic Kingdom, which is my favorite park. So I'm going to select that one. And I think Monday would be a great day for Magic Kingdom. So here we are, Monday, September 16th. You know, this is great. It has a map to kind of show you Magic Kingdom or where you're going. And then on the left are all your selections. Now, if you see it says Add Attractions and Entertainment, it says select up to three preferences from this group. So you can pick three from that group. And those include It's a Small World, Thunder Mountain, Space Ranger Spin, Celebrate Dream Come True Parade. So as you can see, there are quite a few options to choose from. So that's why we still want you to consult with your agent to make sure you're picking the best rides and attractions for your family. Well, I'm a little thrill seeker, so let's go ahead and do the three mountains that are in Florida. Yes, we do have three mountains. We have Big Thunder Mountain, we have Splash Mountain, and we have Space Mountain. So I'm going to go ahead and select those three mountains, and then I'm going to hit next. And then it's going to give me some other options. So let's see. So these are the best options for the fast passes. We can do 10 to 11 Space Mountain, and then we have Thunder Mountain 4 to 5, and then Splash Mountain 5 to 6. Sure, that works for me. So let's see the other options. There's a few other options that we can choose from. Which, may, this one makes sense, much more sense, because Splash Mountain and Thunder Mountain are right next to each other in Frontierland. And then we can walk over to Space Mountain and then hit the Little Mermaid at the end. But let's check option C as well. And the reason I do that is because, ooh, this is what I like right here. Splash Mountain, you will get soaked. So I always like to do Splash Mountain last so I don't have to walk around in wet clothes all day. So here we have Space Mountain in the morning. Then we can walk right over to Fantasyland and do Under the Sea with Little Mermaid. Thunder Mountain and then Ed with Splash Mountain. That's perfect for me. I'm going to go ahead and hit Next. And now it's confirming my selections. Now, of course, you can make any changes to your FastPass Plus selections if you upload and you have a smartphone. If you upload the My Disney Experience on your smartphone, then you can actually use that right from the theme park. So if you're at the theme parks and decide, oh, I don't want to do Splash Mountain, you can go on there and make that change, or you can also come back to the DisneyWorld.com and do that one as well. So I've got my selections made for my Fast Pass Plus, and then if I want, there's some other little information down here and some fun other rides and attractions to hit during your vacation. But that is it. I am done. I've selected my four Fast Pass Plus for September 16th, and I can just click Done, and I am finished with that day. Now, as you can see, you do only get a few selections at the park, so you do still want to consult with your travel agent 
to make sure that you know you're fitting in between you know we have this little space here from 11 to 1 we're fitting in the best spot to have lunch we're fitting in some other little quick attractions or rides that we can fit in between Space Mountain and Under the Sea Journey with Little Mermaid so you still want to consult with your travel agent to make sure you're still maximizing your time but the new Fast Pass Plus system with the My Disney Experience oh it is amazing you will love it it will save you a lot of time during your Disney vacation so that is how to select your Fast Pass Plus rides and attractions during your Disney World vacation. If you have any questions, call us at 877-918-8941. You can also visit our website at destinationsinflorida.com. Thank you and have a magical day.